Hey guys, it's Piper, and I tried following a Good Chill Studio tutorial to turn my sim into a digital painting, and it did not go well. Well, she did warn me you need a tablet for this kind of shite, but do I ever listen? No. And this video ended up being long, so here is a table of contents at the right. First, I'm going to download some hair because god knows I need more custom content on this shitty computer. What are they even talking about? This site is not ad blocked on my computer. What, you want me to delete the whole thing? God, no. But I'm not, okay? I'm not. Oh, come on! Th you know what? Fuck you. Fuck you. I'm never using your stupid ass site again. Fuck you. Quick, let's pause the video and see what's on Piper's stupid desktop. Boom, here we go, found them. I bulldozed the school in Bridgeport and replaced it with this gigantic house where I put all of my characters from that webcomic that I'm working on but probably won't even start drawing for like years now. <laughs> uh, okay. God damn it, just load. I think show will be my victim, where is you? Okay, grocery store. Okay, we are good now. Uh, let's get rid of that fucking headband. Die, you son of a bitch. Okay. Well, this is fine. I mean, I don't like it that much, but... Okay, let's get your ass home. You have a car, yes? You know what? You go home too. All of y'all. It's like 1.17 a.m. Some of you fuckers have to go to work, right? So why are there no restrooms in the building? This has always pissed me off. Like, none of the rabbit holes have restrooms. So whenever they go out to lots, you have to send them home or to like a bar or something so they can pee. I mean, I know this game is a thousand years old. Decca, what's your problem? Why are you still on the front lawn doing nothing? Go have sex with your girlfriend. I love Woohooer. I don't know what I'd do without it. I made a photography studio. Oh, okay, fine. You can go pee, I guess. Stop having photos taken. You know what? Fuck you. I'm deleting this guy. No, wait, if I kill him, everybody will come running toward him. No, never mind, then. We don't want that. Get out of the walls and just pee. Okay, that's it. Roland Barger. The enemy has been eliminated. Not that bathroom. Okay, let's hurry up now. Well, shit. Get out. I swear, she's so pissy. It was a narrow dodge, but we have done it. You go to bed too, God. They just can't take care of themselves. No, don't rock on the rocking chair. Thank you. Okay, picture time. Okay, let's get a face that doesn't look like constipation. Okay, without the top, she looks naked, alright. You know what, I just want a close-up on the face, so she's naked. Can you make some other face for me? No. Honestly, sims are just inherently ugly. Okay, I've been doing this shit for 20 minutes. I don't think it's gonna get any better. Sorry, show. We're done here. That's right, you hide. Hooray for Skillshare! By the way, um... I'm a teacher here, so I have a referral code. I have to admit that I get $10 every time you sign up, but you get two months for free. So, it's not a bad deal and you can always cancel it if you decide you don't like it. Uh, the class I teach is in the description. 
Okay, first of all, this picture is way too small, so I'm going to resize it, however you do that. Reduce the opacity. Ah! Can you tell I am totally used to this? Okay, fix these fucking eyebrows. I don't know why I'm being so picky. I'm going to draw over them anyway, probably. This blending really pisses me off. Maybe I should go for a more textured brush. Because, like... I feel like the only way I'll be able to make up for my piss-poor blending attempts is to, um, make it look kind of painterly, you know? Alright, let's see this shit. Yeah, I don't really like Krita so far. Maybe if I get used to it some more, I'll like it, but right now I'm just like, meh. I don't really think that Fire Alpaca, though, would be better for this. Just... Fuck it, I'm starting over. Oh my god, the undo levels don't go back far at all. Holy fuck. That's so horrible. I wish I kept the original. Wait, maybe I did. Okay. Okay, good. Now I'm just going to, um, put a spare down here. It's like this never happened, alright? <laughs> it seems everything I do, I just end up fucking it up more. <laughs> I need a break. Okay, I'm I'm just going to start over. I downloaded a new brush pack. Uh, I have a preset palette for show skin. I'm just... <sighs> oh, finally, something with the shame... Shame's shortcut. Shame's shortcut. No, same shortcut. Fuck you. Can I turn off that tooltip that tells me what the zoom level is? Because it's really annoying. I feel like I've been doing this for hours. How long has it been? 11 minutes, okay. Yeah, she looks like an alien now. <laughs> okay, um... Okay, what if I just put, sweep a little bit of purple on it or something? <laughs> a little bit of purple. Why? What made me choose purple anyway? What I want is green. I think. Okay, now I'm just gonna make it opaque. Why isn't there a merge button? Now let's just do this all over again. I'll try this shit out. <sighs> okay. Looking a little better so far. Get rid of this abomination shit right here. Nah, oh, man, I can't do this. It's too splattery for details. And, of course, I can't undo enough. <clears throat> uh, congestion! God, I made this look worse. <laughs> I can't undo all the way back. I'm so sick of this shit. I have no idea what my life is. I don't have this much trouble blending in Fire Alpaca. Okay, so 50% does nothing and 100% is crazy. Why did I have the opacity at 100? Shit. Shit! I wish I could change all of the controls. Like, all of them. <laughs> I'm screaming. They need more undo levels. This really pisses me off. I like to work in lots of tiny strokes. You'd think I wouldn't get so pissy about this since I'm used to Microsoft Paint XP, which only has three levels of undo, but... But I am, so... 
This is taking forever and I want to die. Alright, she starts with this black thing that she just kind of smears on top. Where's the airbrush tool? I think that's what she used. I don't remember. I'm too lazy to look. Well, I'd multiply it, but it's all pretty much the same color anyway, so... Okay, I've been working on this for like two hours. <laughs> Kill me! Okay, for the lashes, I'm just gonna wing it. Oh god, this is so horrible. Shit. Is there an option like Fire Alpaca where you can just automatically taper the ends if you don't have a tablet? Probably not. No, man, this- it just looks too bad. Well, apparently, all this time, I was not recording sound. Fuck my life. Okay, I spent a shit ton of time getting rid of the jaggies here. I fixed her eyebrows, and I did her eyelashes in Fire Alpaca, because there's no taper tool in, uh, Krita that I am aware of. Doesn't mean there isn't one, just I couldn't find it. So, the ear, I think I'll just paint it. Maybe with a different brush, though. I honestly never put much effort into the ears. What am I doing? She's not a fucking elf. Most of this is going to be covered up. Actually, I usually start with a darker color, so I'll do that. Okay. Can you tell that I have no idea what I'm doing? This is annoying the shit out of me. so tired of doing this. Okay, uh, let's do the mouth. I hate how every time I switch a brush, this setting changes again. It makes me really mad. Okay, now that I'm getting used to it, it's not so bad. Okay, there's the move thing. And she just kind of drew a line here for the lips. And that's all she did to it, pretty much, but uh, it's just impossible for me to get show's proper lip shape down. Of course, then again, it was an eye tutorial, so I don't know, she probably does more t I think I remember her doing more to the lips in some of her other edits. I don't know. Not that I, like, have to do what she does. I just... I'm following a tutorial, I guess. Following a tutorial... For a program I don't know how to use. Actually, she's using Photoshop, not Krita, but she says you can use Krita. <laughs> I think I want it to be a little wider on top. But a little less bowed, too. Cupid y or whatever. And of course, I basically removed the line. Can you tell? I guess. Fuck it, I'll just fix it. Okay, some of this looks like way more painterly than other parts, so I'm just going to kind of fudge it. No, that, that opacity is way too deep, okay. This brush is too big. Nice, I guess. I think I just made it like 60 times worse, but I bet the undo levels won't go back far enough for me to fix it. Yeah. Okay. Make that nose nice and buttony. <laughs> I know, I can't talk and paint at the same time, but I am trying because a speed paint would look so stupid because I have no idea what I'm doing. I'm just kind of I don't know. Smoothing. Blending. Smoothing. Blending. Oh god, this looks like shit. <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh my god, what have I done? Oh my god. This forehead looks pretty bad. By bad, I just mean kind of grainy. I'm taking a break from the nose. I just... Ugh. 
Just get rid of these little strands. I'll make them better later. What? Why is all of this on a new layer? Well, that means I can just erase the nose. I don't remember making a new layer. Bye, nosy. Okay, I've been gentle with the shading so far on attempt number two. I'm just going to stick close to the original and hope that pays off. I'm also using a reference this time and I'm copying it kind of closely. I just googled button nose. <laughs> Alright, I guess this is okay. Honestly, better than it was before is good enough for me. Sims tend to have a low contrast, so I think the nose is a little too dark and contrasty. Give that back. Sorry. Ugh, no! I don't want it up there! No! Fucking critter. So far, these are all the edits I've made. I think I accidentally made her eyes smaller than they're supposed to be, though. So I'm gonna test out this move feature and see if it's garbage or not. Okay. What? Layer is invisible. Oops. <laughs> I've thought about giving her bigger eyes, though, in the past. I'm not sure if I actually want them to be that small. I don't- I don't know. I don't want to make them double lidded though. I specific. <laughs> this is kind of sounds so dumb. The reason I made show, shit. The reason I gave show mono lids <laughs> was because they're easier to paint. <laughs> I know I'm ridiculous and so lazy. I'm also going to tone down these nostrils. Okay, that looks more like how I imagined her nose. How long have I been working on her nose now? Like six years? God, I'm running out of things to do. I don't want to do the hair. <sighs> I have to. I have to. I wonder if this is like a solid white or if I'm just shitting myself. That's not what I expected to happen. Okay, I think from here I'm just going to do stuff. And things will happen. And uh, then I'll be done. Oh my god, this looks like shit. Who let me learn to art? Why would anybody allow me to do this? Oh my god, I'm dying. Okay. Why is it doing this right here? Oh my god, it's still doing it. It's just slightly off. You know what? Fuck it. She's just gonna have crinkly fucking eyelashes. That's all there is to it. Uh, I've... And it's so sudden too. These look fine. I hate my life. I'm going to use my hair watercolor brush. All these hair brushes I made myself. Feels good to be in my home program. Does that sound weird? I feel like I'm spending all this time fixing the shit that I was trying to do in, um, Krita. <laughs> you know, this correction does not need to be up that high. It's just smoothly going through it. This whole thing right here, that was a mistake. I should have never fucked with the hair on Krita. I should have just used Fire Alpaca. The problem... I know a lot of people tell me to use Krita, but I just can't. There's just not enough tools to make up for the fact that I use a mouse. Fire Alpaca has a lot of tools like that. You can adjust the minimum width and opacity by pressure to make it kind of artificially imitate the pen pressure. But if Krita has tools like that, I couldn't find them anywhere. Nobody's ever told me of tools like that. I couldn't find anything, so... I'm just going to assume for now that they don't exist. Maybe I'll return to Krita and give it more of a fair shot when I have a tablet. 
am going to start asking some tablet companies if they would if there's some kind of arrangement we could make like me reviewing their tablet and then I can have one uh, and if that doesn't work out then oh well I guess I'll have to cry okay I made a lot of mistakes <laughs> now for the other side let's add some colors Oh fuck, I can't use clipping. This isn't a transparent layer. <laughs> okay, whatever. I'll just fix it later. So far, it looks okay, actually. Back to Krita. Oh wow, that really does look better. Back to having no idea what I'm doing. Actually, this whole project has been an experiment, honestly. Can you tell I'm so excited to be working on this still after several hours? I'm doing the makeup in Fire Alpaca. Alright, first I'll start with the eyeliner. Oh my god, I forgot to do the eyes! <laughs> well, okay, I guess makeup is not the last thing I'm doing. Even when I'm drawing, I can't get the eyeliner even. God. See, I just need a textured brush. Actually, how about my freckled brush? Really small. Yeah, we'll just give her some shiny shit. Um, no, maybe on the inner corner of her eye. Okay, one more layer. I'm just gonna use an airbrush layer, maybe. Mmm, no, let's use this one. I'm just going to apply it over the whole thing rather evenly. Set that to multiply, and it looks like shit. Hooray. That's exactly what I was going for. For it to look like complete fucking shit. What? No! What did I do wrong? Okay. Final opacity adjustment. Okay, we got that part down. Now let's give her a little bit of a smoky eye because I like those. I think they're flattering. This isn't working. It's just not blended enough. Actually, let's put a Gaussian blur on it. I'm so fucking lazy. And erase anything that might have fallen down here. I forgot to give her a bottom row of eyelashes. Oh my god, I am. <laughs> oh my god, what am I doing? I need to rethink my entire life. Multiply, move it up just a teeny bit. I wonder if the same thing, if we can just... <laughs> I'm not lazy. <clears throat> uh, I'm congested. Back to Krita again. Uh, I decided I liked the way her mouth looked more before. But I deleted that layer. I only have the original now. And I changed the colors of the skin, so I can't just delete. Hold on, maybe I still have it? Nope. It is dead. Just like my dreams. You see, she has this mouth curve up in here. And originally it was just because I couldn't get her lips the way it looked in her concept art, but I decided that I kind of like the way it looks, so I'm going to go back to that. I'm also going to try to make her eyes a little bit larger. I think I already did that, but I want to do it again. Because I lost a little bit of the size when I put her eyelashes on. Okay, we'll do that first. Oh, where is it? I have not used this brush yet. Please do well. I think it's like the liquify tool. Yeah. I mean, obviously I don't want it to look like that. Okay. Up. Just a little bit. Okay. I wish I knew how to eye. I don't think I've ever painted a detailed eye before now that I think of it. Yeah, I'm just gonna kinda squiggle. Yay, squiggle! I, I know exactly what I'm doing. And she said to make little shiny things, so that's what I'm gonna do. I always do ring lighting. 
If you don't know what I mean by ring lighting, if you've ever watched a YouTuber and you've seen this little ring around their eyes, it's because they have a circular light. And I decided I kind of like the look. So I duplicate it when I make anime eyes. Duplicate is not the right word, Piper. You mean replicate, I think. God, I don't even know what I mean anymore. I don't even know why I talk. Just shoot me. I did a really shitty job though and it just looks like she's crying. At the best, I want it to look like she just got done crying. Does that make sense? Let's see, what did I say I wanted to fix? The mouth? Yeah. We've come a long way. Let's give this bitch some makeup. Now I kind of miss that redness in her nose for some reason. I don't know. I'm just going to... Let's try this Rudolph shit again. I guess it's okay-ish. Oh no, the hair. I know how to fix this. Okay, I'm just gonna take purple, a really dark purple, and um, watercolor. Now let's go to multiply, and let's reduce the saturation. Similar to that on the left, yes. Yeah. It pisses me off that I did all this reducing redness only to put a pink filter over the whole thing. Dang. That just basically erased her. Once again, soft light seems to be my friend. I don't know. Overall, I consider this a failure because show does not look exactly the way she does in my imagination, and some parts, like the mouth, I think actually look more off than before, so... <laughs> well, uh, it could have been worse. I will admit that. It could have been a lot worse. <laughs>